Hi there! Today we're diving into the world of 24-hour ambulatory blood pressure monitors. Now, I know that sounds like a bit of a handful, but stick with me and I'll break it down. So, what is this monitor all about? It's basically a device that measures your blood pressure continuously over a 24-hour period. It comes with a standard inflatable cuff attached to a small, computer-like portable device that you can wear over your shoulder or on a belt. This nifty gadget takes blood pressure readings every 15 to 30 minutes while you go about your day and even while you sleep. ABPM is recommended for individuals with suspected white coat hypertension where blood pressure spikes in clinical settings, or mass hypertension where readings appear normal at the doctor's office but are elevated at home. It's also useful for monitoring the effectiveness of blood pressure medications, diagnosing nocturnal hypertension, and assessing patients with fluctuating or episodic blood pressure. ABPM is particularly beneficial for those at high risk of cardiovascular disease as it provides a more accurate risk assessment. If your blood pressure readings are stable and consistent and you don't have risk factors for cardiovascular disease, ABPM might not be necessary. Home monitoring can typically suffice for routine checks. However, it's important to consult your health care provider to determine your, the best approach for your specific needs. ABPM is generally not recommended for individuals who find the device uncomfortable or have conditions that make frequent cuff inflations problematic. Ambulatory blood pressure monitoring offers several advantages. Namely, it captures blood pressure during daily activities and sleep, providing a more accurate and reproducible assessment. It eliminates the white coat effect and identifies nocturnal hypertension, which most home monitors cannot do. However, ABPM can be uncomfortable due to frequent cuff inflations and is more expensive than home monitoring. Home monitors, while convenient and affordable, may not detect fluctuations or nighttime hypertension, potentially leading to misdiagnosis or inadequate treatment. Thus, it's important to talk to your doctor about which approach is right for you. Keep in mind that this test isn't covered by OHIP and there's a fee ranging between $75 to $100, although some private insurances may cover it. After the 24-hour period of this test, you return the cuff and monitor, and a specialist will analyze the recordings and send the report to your doctor who can then look at various statistics like your average blood pressure variations and distribution patterns. The cuff typically inflates every 20 minutes until 10 p.m. and every half hour afterwards until 6 a.m. If you've had a mastectomy or are on permanent hemodialysis, let the technician know as it will affect the arm positioning. If you're a shift worker, make sure to inform the technician so they can program your monitor correctly. In addition, if you feel symptoms like dizziness, headaches, or facial flushing, or if your heart rate starts racing, you might be asked to press the manual button on the monitor for a manual reading. You will also be asked to fill out a form or diary to track your symptoms, any vigorous activity, stressful episodes, the times and dosages of your meds, and your sleep throughout the monitoring period. Furthermore, it's important that when the cuff inflates, you try to keep your arms still and relax straight down at the side of your body. For more information on the device and its care, contact the administering organization such as Life Labs. Ambulatory blood pressure monitoring is highly reliable and accurate, with studies suggesting it to be a gold standard for diagnosing hypertension. It reduces the risk of my misdiagnosis by providing multiple readings over 24 hours compared to a single clinic measurement. Research indicates that ABPM has higher sensitivity and specificity for detecting hypertension, being it a superior tool for guiding treatment decisions. For example, it can confirm whether a reading like 175 over 100 is consistent or an anomaly, ensuring that treatment is based on accurate data. In summary, ambulatory blood pressure monitoring is a valuable tool for understanding your blood pressure and managing your health provides insight that can guide treatment and improve outcomes. Talk to your healthcare provider to see if ABPM is right for you. And for more content like this, be sure to check out the rest of our YouTube channel where we post webinars and small videos. Thank you and have a great day.